Hello, starting at Solitary. It is week 115, I believe, and this week we are discussing pronunciations of words, switchy words, pagan words, and why it matters, if it matters. Um, I wrote down a few, uh, like, some words that may be pronounced differently, like sachet or sachet, uh, lamas, lunasa, the, there's a bunch of variety of terms for that sabbat. Um, sabbat, sabbat, esbat, esbat, um, what's the other one? Uh, athame or athame. There's a many, 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 many different ways of saying a lot of witchy words. Um, some people call the pentagram a pentacle or reverse. Personally, I don't care how you pronounce words as long as it's understood what you're saying honestly if it's like tomato tomato potato potato like different parts of the united states um pronounce things differently like i live in washington i don't add an r into washington but a lot of washingtonians do it drives me a little batty but that's just that's the way they say it um and that's fine um there is really no reason why you can't pronounce things slightly different, particularly if, say you're from another country, most likely you're going to pronounce it a little differently. Um, like another language is your primary language. Um, and also just different regions, as said before, pronounce a lot of things in different ways. Like even Americans versus <laughs> uh, Britain, we all pronounce most of the things slightly differently. Again, that's fine. We could have arguments in circles, but when it comes down to it, you know what the fuck we're saying. <laughs> um, I think some people do believe that how you pronounce things um, can affect the energy. It only can affect the energy if you allow it to, in my opinion. A lot of people will argue with that. But, you know, overall, I say pronounce things the way you're most comfortable, comfortable pronouncing them because you're the one using the words. So that's it for now. Talk to you later. Bye.